I didn't suspect anything. They just rifled through the mess. A Southside retiree thought he was talking to a tree trimmer, but it turns out it was just a trick to take advantage of him. And now the Marine veteran is warning others about what he says was all a cover for a home burglary. And tonight, our David McAnally on how those criminals somehow managed to scam him and why he believes and thinks the victim says they're no amateurs. Hey, it's that season when somebody claiming they're a tree trimmer shows up, says, oh, looks like you need to have your tree cut, or maybe they say they're a lawnscaping guy. South Side man found they may be there for another reason. He set up in his favorite spot. I was just sitting out there in the chair in my garage. The Korean War era U.S. Marine enjoying what was a sunny day at his home off County Line Road. The guy come walking up the driveway. He wanted to talk to me about trimming my trees. And I thought, well, they could use trimming. They walked around the back and the side of the house to get a look at some of the trees that might need to be done. And all the time, he says, as they're walking, the man is doing something else that he didn't think was strange at the time. All the time, he's talking on his cell phone in Spanish. He first thought the guy was on the phone with his company, but now he figures the person on the other end of the cell phone was probably up here, walking into Bill Sudcamp's bedroom, going through his dresser for valuables, while the first guy kept Bill distracted out on the lawn. And that's when they stole her watch, the Cougar Ann, and my uh, Star Sapphire 18 karat gold ring. All valuable gold items, he says, are all gone. The gold Krugerrand coin was in a gold setting with gold chain. They left behind costume jewelry. They knew the difference, he says. I did never see the other guy. Never saw him. Never saw him when he came. Never saw him when he left. It's disheartening to the 86-year-old who served his country. His friend is just happy that she wasn't in the house alone when the man came in. I didn't suspect a thing, you know. And he shook my hand, and he left. I guess I, I, I don't suspect people. After looking at the trees, he says the man left in a black Nissan subcompact car. Police always warn that if somebody comes to your door offering services uninvited, be really cautious. David McAnally, Channel 13 Eyewitness News.